The prosecutor got the elements that he wanted. And so there's different ways to do this. But from my perspective, if I were prosecuting this, I would have started out in a much more low key fashion. And what I've been looking for was an agreement on a whole series of things. Frankly, even the agreement of her last story, get her to lay it all out with specificity. And then once you get all of that, then you overlay all of the mistakes on the back end. Because what you're doing then is you're establishing how she looks so honest, so credible, so willing to tell the jury, quote unquote, the truth. And then you lay lie after lie after lie after lie over the top of it on the back end of that cross because the jury can't look away. And and that's really what they're going to be watching for. What I saw was a really aggressive approach that I think hurt the prosecutor in a way that wasn't necessary. We've talked about this, you and I. The thing is, is that it's always easy to ramp up. It's very difficult to ramp down. That's true.